Hi guys, D900man here from MargaretIphone.com and we've got another review for you today. Well, not so much a review, but this is a video all about Siri dictation. So if you've been out and brought an iPhone 4S, one of the key things that made you do that was probably Siri and the ability to speak to your phone and it interpret that and put words directly on the screen for you. But in order for you to do that and for Siri to get it right, there's certain commands that you have to use for punctuation. Commands such as new line and paragraph. So let's see how some of these work. So if you don't know about the iPhone 4S, iOS 5 or Siri, in this iPhone 4S and iOS 5, it's got this new button next to the spacebar and this is a microphone button and when you press that it will enable the speech to text program. So we'll just click this. Siri dictation, new line. And as you can see, once I did that and pressed the done button, it contacted Apple servers, come back, and it told us exactly what it wanted to do. So I did use the word Siri dictation, and you'll probably have noticed that I used the word words new line, and that is the command to take it down to the next line. And there's different commands. Say I wanted to start a new paragraph. New paragraph, how are you all today? And it took me down two lines to start a new paragraph and said exactly what I wanted it to say. It will also do capital letters. New line, cap, bacon. And that cap was exactly what I wanted it to do. It, it put a capital at the start of the word bacon. It will also do whole words in capitals and I need to use the words all caps. New paragraph, I want some food, all caps, now. Now, it didn't pick up the word now, it thought I said mat, but it heard the command all caps and put mat in all caps. Now, there's absolutely loads of these, and if you head over to Migrate iPhone, we'll have a whole list of what these mean, so you can read through them and practice them in your own time. But it will understand other punctuation such as commas and capital letters and full stops or periods. Um, it will do quotes and a whole list of other things. So let's just go through some of those. Full stop. And as you can see, it added a full stop at the end of that. So let's go through some more of the other different types of signs. And this is where Siri gets really clever. New paragraph, exclamation point, inverted exclamation point, question mark, inverted question mark. And it picked up all of those. So it's not just words and certain punctuation. Siri can pretty much do anything. It'll even do some of those signs that you're using that, you know, I can't even find on my keyboard. So let's try some of those out. New paragraph, percent sign. Copyright sign, registered sign, section sign, dollar sign, cent sign, euro sign, yen sign, degree sign, carrot, at sign, pound sterling sign, hash sign. And it even did all those. And there's loads and loads more. Hey, it even does smiley faces. New paragraph, smiley face, frowny face, winky face. And it even gives us smileys. So you pretty much nowadays don't even have to touch your keyboard. And there's a certain member on our team that hasn't actually typed anything on his iPhone 4S since he got it. He's been using Siri dictation for everything. So I hope this video's kind of given you some information about Siri and actually how to use it. Um, please give it a thumbs up if you like it. So thanks very much for watching. I've been D900Man. And remember to click that subscribe button above. We'll catch you real soon.